Hey guys, what's up? So I'm just going to be giving you guys another update. So, okay, so tomorrow, be praying for me. I have to go in to the driver's place, the DMV, and I'm taking my test. So pray that that will go well. And secondly, the other day, I happened to be shopping with my dad at Market Basket, and I got a little something-something. And that is oh, a succulent plant. So I just propagated one leaf, and what propagated or whatever that term is, um, it means that you take off a leaf of the succulent and you actually create another succulent from that leaf. Um, you see, succulents are plants that rege uh, re la 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 rejuvenate themselves. And what that means is that no matter what part of the plant that you take off, it will always regrow another one, which is pretty awesome. Um, so it's a good investment if you are a plant person and you want to um, have a lot. The only downside to having a succulent, I found out, is that even though you can propagate or whatever that term is to uh, rejuvenate the plant um, to create another one, the process is very long. But if you have the patience, um, it's a very good beginner plant as well because you can leave it um, out for like a week and not have to water it. Even though you do have to water on occasions, it's kind of like a cactus plant where you don't actually have to check up on it on a daily basis, which is really nice for those of us who don't garden or don't do anything of that sort at all. So here's just another look at it. Here's a close-up. And as you can see right there, I propagated one of the leaves because it looked like it wasn't doing too well. So I just stuck it in the soil. And um, what you do to propagate a plant, so you peel the plant um, leaf off the stem and you stick it in. Typically, you're supposed to have a tray of dirt and it's just supposed to be like slightly moist dirt and like not too damp, um, but just like just a little bit of water. And then after the um, tip of the uh, leaf that you tore off from the plant after that has scarred over because when you take off the leaf the end that you tore off that end will be a little bit um, damp looking so once that actually hardens o um, over into like a scar looking thing then you put that into the dirt and then you let it grow and it all you have to do is um, spray some water on it on a weekly basis like once a week maybe and maybe not even that and um, you don't leave it in direct sunlight make sure you leave it in indirect sunlight but yeah I'll give you guys more updates on the succulent as it starts growing because I just just did that so um yeah Oh, and in other news, um, so in about two weeks from now, there's going to be basketball tryouts at my school, and I'm going to be trying out for it again this year. Um, I was on the varsity team last year, so hopefully I make it again. Fingers crossed. But if I do make it again, I just want to let you I just want to let you guys know that if I do make it again this year, um, that it might be a little more difficult for me to upload vlogs on a daily basis. So I might turn this into weekly basis, if that's the word, and or I might do like two, like twice a week or something like that. I'll let you guys know depending on my schedule and the busyness of um, that and work and everything else. So. So thanks guys for watching again and keeping up with me and my life. And hopefully as this year is getting closer and closer and closer to the end of the year. I mean, I know that's like way far out. Like way far out. But as soon as I graduate, because I'm a senior this year in high school. As soon as I graduate, um, this will be a lot more frequent and I hope to keep up with these updates a lot more frequent throughout the summer and um, hopefully next year I'll be making this more of a full-time thing and so you'll be seeing a lot of more of me in the upcoming year. So with that, thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!